and cut. Hello everyone, this is Mike Check 95 with another Let's Play of Little Hope. I'm with my cohorts. Krieger, <laughs> Krieger Margin 1. And Jokester. And let's get this fucking Let's Play done with. Please. Just wait on you, sir. Oh my god. Time to talk to Mike Stark. Mike, look at that. May 28th. Andrew, Little Hope, no, Police Station. This is ears. Pop 26 AM. This is ears. Ah! What do you think? Optimistic. Doubtful. Chicken. Don't Arr! remember what was going on in this game at all. Let's take a look around. Yeah. Let's take a look around. See what we can find. There you go. We'll be on our way from Little Hope while the others are still MIA in the woods. Something up? Yeah, there's something kind of familiar about this place. These small town police stations all look the same. Well, I guess we're investigating the police station. There's got to be a phone in here somewhere. There's got to be a phone in here somewhere. Take some a look around. It looks like no one's been in here for a long time. Is this the Resident Evil 2 police station? He did say he looked familiar. Maybe he's a gamer. <laughs> Hello, Leon Jr. Uh, oh, well, uh, I guess that cat meant useless. It was a victim of rust. A victim of rust. And zombies. Go look in the kitchen. Can I have a cup of coffee? You okay? Him or me? No. There's a door! Wait, there's a sign. What's the sign say? <laughs> Old Witch Gowl. Built in 1684. Demolished nice. in 1783. In 1692, during the Little Hope Witch Trials, many of the accused were imprisoned here. Do I need to take that away from you? Do we need to take that away from you, jokester? What, are you being annoyed? Sure. Yes. Be the door. Is that a door? Locked. I think you're annoying him more than me right now. Honestly. Honest to God. Alright. I'm gonna get fucking past and turn around in this place. Maybe there's a phone in the lock. What's this? Reynolds. Page Reynolds? Ryan Reynolds. 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 It's one of them kitty cats. It's a, it's a button. Do we know anyone needs to part? There's no, there's no way to put it on your body, though. How is it a button? Uh, you sew it on. It's a patch. Yeah. It's one of those things that you sew on your outfit. I sew. Sew, so. Your work, though. It's in a tutu. Huh? Is that a shotgun? Probably. Who knows? Definitely not a shotgun. It's a piece of wood. Oh, I found a secret. What is the everything that they lost? Everything and nothing at the same time. It has to be after this concrete building was in, installed. Therefore, it has to be after the addition of concrete. Therefore, it's after the pilgrims. I don't know where that's from. That's interesting. What? Oh, uh, well, that door's locked. Um, apparently, no one knows how to uh, unlock things anymore. I haven't found a single key. Well, I haven't seen a single key. Well, that's because I'm getting lost in this police station. Wait, this is a police station? Yes. Oh, look. Explains the badge. Hence the badge. I thought it was a school. He said police station in the beginning, the old man. Why was it listening to the old man? You're too busy you crinkling that Nerf gun in your ass. A middle-aged man. Mike likes being shot. How convenient. A phone on a desk. In the police station. Do I really have to fucking face the phone like this to fucking use it? We have a winner. We have a winner. Found a phone. This could be our way out. Mine's dead. <laughs> Shit! Whoa! Hey!
Take it easy. I'm thinking I know what's wrong. Please do share. There's no cable. Uh, there's a cable here someplace. Uh, yeah, but there's no power. There's got to be a cable here someplace. Well, you see, the cable doesn't require power. The the the, the phone system itself prevents. Am I really going to have to search the entire fucking building That's for a goddamn phone cable? That's exactly why pay phones work. They don't have to be connected. I want to go this way, but our fucking chair's in the way. It, it, we're playing Sims. <laughs> now, nah, Mike, you're just terrible at the controls. No, I just terrible at this game. Look, it's a shiny thing in there. Is that there a cable? Were multiple shiny things. It's a hippie necklace. It actually says hippie on the bag. <laughs> on the box. It's a heavy junk. TC. That seems important. Not at all. Who's initial to BTC? Uh, Tom Cruise. Oh, yes. Tom Cruise. <laughs> He's brother. a hippie. Tom Cruise is a hippie? Hippie Jim. In the flashback, what was his younger brother's name? Uh, Derps? Yeah, Derps. Was, was it was Taylor or something? Or is that the girl? So I can't even say soda. Have you already looked at that mic thing on the wall? Yes. What is that? What do you think? Answer it. I can do this. Be careful. Don't stress it, Professor. I should not be here this day. I stand there falsely accused. I all the What can you hear? A woman. She sounds real upset. Talk to her. Try to get some details, her location, anything we can use to find her. Not all every little hopper will leave for the truth to out. Can I ask, what's your name? As I walked, a man appeared at my front. I reached out in fear. I had not seen him approach. This man I had never seen before. His clothes and manner of speaking were not familiar to me. He spoke of things I did not understand. Okay, it's all good. I'm gonna help you out here if I can, but I... I need to know your name. <laughs> I'm so falsely accused of crime. That's boop dee dee boop You about shove that nerf gun up your ass. Here, girl. I would speak with you. You cannot talk of our secret. Eternal damnation awaits if you do. We have an understanding, do we not? No evil words shall leave my lips. Should you breathe a word, or the edge of a word about the other things, then I will come to you in the black of some terrible night and bring a reckoning that will shudder you. Now, Reverend, let us begin. Enough time has gone begging. Go be with you, kin. I beseech this court, and good Judge Wyman, do not be fooled by the protestations of the accused. The devil is the master of deceit. All his servants feign innocence. They can do little else. I solemnly swear before God, I am innocent of all accusations against Hush me. Hush now, Amy. What the hell should we do? Stay quiet. We just let this play out. See what happens. I mean no offense, Reverend Carver. I do not believe any of my neighbors, those who know me best, will speak out against me. They know who I am, that I side with the righteous. I will not be caught in the web of your deception. The devil hides himself where he is least expected. My wife is no devil's plaything, Reverend. I beg the court's forgiveness, but I stand by my statement. My wife Amy is innocent. I respectfully ask this good court to pay no mind to the words of a man whose very home is foul with the stench of brimstone.
beg your good judge. Let us conclude our business here without further ado. Lest we afford the forces of darkness the opportunity to bend these proceedings to their will. No! Mary? Mary, my sister, what ails you? What the? Stay out of this. What have you done to this child? You have bound an innocent girl into a pact with the devil himself. The poor creature seems possessed. No doubt you're doing. It's not true, Reverend. Why have you turned against me, sir? We will the see the truth of it. Of Amy, lay your hands on Mary. Let us see what occurs. If I am correct, your you touch will no release danger. her from this affliction. It must be so if you are the one who bewitched her. I don't think I can take much more of this. I think it's almost over. They are here among us. They are here among us. No! What more proof is needed that the devil walks among us in little hope? <laughs> Take heed and pray. The devil is here in this very room. Protect yourselves. Seek out the Lord. What the hell was that shit? Was that for real? Felt pretty damn real to me. Seriously? Didn't the witch trials happen centuries ago? Most of them over 300 years ago. Then how come we just saw one? Like I say, I have no good explanation. That little girl who had some kind of seizure. What do you think was going on there? I know that little girl. She's the one me and Angela saw back in the woods. Accusations were often malicious, made by someone with a grudge. Or by meddling liars, like that little girl, who took perverse pleasure in poisoning their own communities. Come on. She's just some little kid who most likely doesn't get how big a deal the whole thing is. She knows exactly how serious it is. Either way, the woman on trial, Angela 2.0, she seemed like she saw us. And so did some of the others. A little kid just seeing us appear out of nowhere could easily believe that was witchcraft, especially back then. Dream up all the excuses you want for that little kid. I don't trust her one little bit. We can't explain how we happen to see each other. How do you expect some little girl from 300 years ago to wrap her head around it? The woman we just saw condemned? I saw her back at the intersection. I noticed something else weird. Her husband? He looked a lot like you, Professor. The two people with that little brat look just like Daniel and Taylor. What the hell does all this mean? Who's that? Hey, Professor! You in there? Come on, let's go. Hey, Taylor, we're in here! We can't open the damn doors! Uh, we can't either! They must be locked! Let's all try to force the handle. In three, two, one. Taylor. Hey, Professor. Find anything that could get us out of here? Nah, big fat nothing back there. Just a pile of junk. Are you okay? I'm okay. Under the circumstances. You know about the trial? What trial? What's he talking about? We saw your exact double. She was accused of being involved in witchcraft. 
Why didn't you tell me any of this? I was going to tell you, but my head was still a little messed up from what we saw. It's garbage. Don't make weak excuses. What happened to the woman accused, Angela's lookalike? She stood trial and was condemned for witchcraft. Find that out. We've already been down those paths. Maybe the answer lies down the one path we haven't taken yet. What the hell? You must think I've lost my mind. You're not crazy. You're doing what you believe is right. And for me, that's a good thing. Gosh, time for you to finally play! Put your phone down. About time, you old fuck! For the best decision. He's not old, she's old. He's playing. He's middle aged. He's playing the middle aged. John, main fuck. road. 1240. May 28th, 2094. Lead your student towards town. You must lead them. 2090. Be the leader you wish to be. Worse. 1249. They're getting ahead of you. You must lead them. Hey. Don't let them lead you. Yeah, we haven't been checking Why is she sets. fucking power walking? She wants to get out of here. Who she think she is? Dwayne the Rock Johnson? No, scared lady. Who's in search of the Mike, who are you? Who are you, Mike? Huh? You're Dunder Mifflin face. Dunder Mifflin? Dunder Mifflin face. No, I'm ears and derp. Yes, Dunder Mifflin face. Ears and, and logic dirt. boy. Ears and derp. No, la logic boy and Dunder Mifflin. Ears and derp. Mifflin! Ears Mifflin. and derp. Muffin face. Derp. Muffin face. Derp! Mike, you're a muffin face. I, I thank you. And chicken head. Dylan's a noodle brain, and I'm a swashbuckler. Dylan's actually a giraffe. Oh yes, I remember the bridge. Is that where Satan says hello? This was the bridge we were going to earlier. No, that was a totally different bridge. No, it's well, the same bridge. Well, I remember. No, because this bridge. bridge has holes in it. Can't see for sure. New shit. bridge has holes in it. Oh, well. The other bridge shit. was a covered bridge. Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! There's a hole You can't see shit. It's like the only light they've seen in the entire game. It's right there. Anywhere near. Okay. Who's first up? Huh. Professor, you keep telling us you're in charge. So. Okay. Sure thing. Is it safe to cross? Don't stress. The professor and me will make sure you get across, no problem. Right, we'll, we'll get you over for sure. So if it's rough, yell at one person across the time. Yeah, I don't know why they put three people in there all at once. Oh no! They're split up. Well, apparently they've never been athletic in their entire life. If well, there goes Taylor and Dirk. What do we do? We can't stay here. Now they're going to have sex in the woods. What do we do? We can't stay here. No, they're going to stand on the bridge and have a panic attack. Yeah. Why did he do that? He could have literally, literally just stretched one foot over. Be careful. Be careful, Krieger. I know, but it's a burning. Uh, or a lot. It's a burning. In this year of our Lord, 1692, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No! Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I 
have done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. I don't know how to help you. Tell me what I can do. Please, sir. You must help me. You must. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, let us conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. You cannot do this! For Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he come for us all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poisoned from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. In Little Hope, he has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by accuser. While Mary still draws breath, little hope remains beyond salvation. There lies your evil reference to your very fix. Isaac. into the river in chains. That's pretty shaky. The drown was pushed into the river. There we go. Is that what you're talking about, Dylan? No. I was talking about the way she died. She she drowned. How did she look when she died? Dead. How else? <laughs> How the time that, that character died that looked like that. Huh? She looked exactly the way she looked whenever she died. You know what? When, when, when is Josh? Gonna, when is jokes are gonna get the controller back? All right, I'll go. First. Hey, that's the first time I've had the controller since like. It's because y'all been making uh, crap decisions. Okay, mm -hmm. no, we're making good decisions. Okay, you two, get on down. You were making decisions. You didn't know what you were talking about. Okay, you two. Away. Oh. 
must have been a glitch. Woo! Check like the wind bulls are. Like remember the remember the things. Looks like I made the right choice. I told you, remember ah. the vision. Yes, I made the right choice. Ah! Phew, that was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. Well done. Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. Given the way in which the stakes have been elevated, some kind of weapon might be useful about now. Don't you think? You really should have explored more thoroughly, you know. Too late now. The boys have some interesting theories. Maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory, that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood with that sour ferryman, which poets write of, unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> it's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death, and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out. Hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? <laughs> okay then. We will once again turn to the bard for some cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act 5, scene 1, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. Thoughts? Thoughts? It's over. Thoughts on the hint? Yeah, what's your thoughts on the hint? We'll discuss the hint for a little bit before we pass the control. I, We're only in Act 1. Long haul. I traveled the furthest. Um, Mike had the most relationship increases. And Jokester, he, he chose the most smart decisions. Brain, your left side of your brain instead of your right. So what are you? Well, thoughts? how could I have walked the furthest? You literally had the control for so the, much longer than me. I walked the furthest. That's what I'm saying. I had the least amount of like control. Actually, I think. Okay, so this is Act One mm -hmm. of the whole thing. Oh I think I walked goodness. the furthest because I had that really long mm -hmm. beginning part that was all mine, and then you guys had it for a really long. Well, I got. I look at the lady like inside the room for a little bit. Um, I would like to say that. At the beginning, I was trying to interpret because I had the controller first. I was trying to interpret like, where, what's up with the bus? I don't want to go back to the bus, and it was all messed up. I, I wasn't able to read the thingies really fast, and we were quite loud. That is okay. And then you guys had the controller a bunch. So, um, but I first I did, of all, I theories. Did, I thought she was supposed to be angry, Ooh. so I played the first character. Saying, but she seemed to have softened out. So, so Michael, your theory from the opening of the game. Does it still stand? Do you think they're in purgatory? The purgatory, and they might be stuck in that time loop. It could in be some shape, way, or form. I think it's what is happening. Not like an exact time loop, but a time loop in their own, like, 
that's what I think. So happened. is the bus driver in the time loop too, or what do you think happened to him? I think the bus driver is their one way out. Because they keep alluding to the bus driver that he's important. I think it's something different. I think the original was an original thing that happened, and stupid things happened. Yes. And so when it turned around again, they were given a second chance, but in the form of family, and they screwed it up. So they said, this time, we'll give them different identities, all coming around a certain scenario to to refix the original situation. And so it's not that they're much, so much stuck in purgatory, but they're stuck in this time loop kind of a thing, or like a history loop, until they fix it. You know what I, what I really enjoy about this game? So I've played this once before, and I know what's going to happen in one scenario. So only if we go in this direct scenario, I know exactly how the story turned out. But if we pick other paths, the story will turn out different. So I am in the dark, but I also have some light. So I'm like, I just realized, like, I'm thinking, and I'm just like, wow, okay, well, this person's doing this, and this person, that's not actually how it is. There's like seven different ways that this game can go. And you might be in the same spot or in the same direction, but because we made different choices, it ends a different way. But yes. we could also be on our own different path. That's what I'm just going to be splitting up. Yes. Okay, well, let's continue on to Act 2. Oh. <laughs>